Hayden Singleton. Today, I would like to tell you about four key landmarks that were instrumental in the Civil Rights Movement. McKinley High School. The original McKinley Senior High School building on Thomas Delphi Drive holds the distinction of being the oldest black high school in Baton Rouge and the oldest in Louisiana. In the summer of 1953, McKinley High School became ground zero for planning the Baton Rouge bus boycott. Organizers of the eighth day boycott held meetings at McKinley to discuss strategy and raise gas money for our car lift program so that their supporters could still get around town. McKinley was built in 1926 and opened in 1927. Over the years, McKinley made a few changes. First serving as a high school, then from 1960s through the 1980s, it was used as a Head Start program. In 1981, McKinley was added to the National Register of Historic Places. AZ Young Park is located at 800 3rd Street next to Pentacon Barracks and Capitol Park. It is marked by a Louisiana Civil Rights Trail Marker dedicated on August 21st, 2021 by the Louisiana Department of Tourists and it's also marked by a sign. This was the first and the longest march that was honored in the Civil Rights Movement at a 105 mile march. Activist A.Z. Young, along with Robert Bob Hicks and Gail Jenkins, led the Bogalusa to Baton Rouge Civil Rights March. They started their journey on August 10, 1967, and they called it the 105 mile gauntlet. As they, as they faced substantial opposi opposition and required needed protection from the National Guards and Police Department. The march grew from 25 to 600 people on August 20th, 1967, where A.Z. Young presented a list of grievances to Governor John McKeeson as he talked about the employment discrimination and about the election of 10 black Americans running for the local offices in Bogalusa, where they rallied on the steps of the state capitol. Chicken Shack. Chicken Shack is the oldest black-owned restaurant in Baton Rouge as well as the city's oldest restaurant that is still in business. The Eatery Chicken Shack is known for its knuckle-sucking good chicken, which can be found at four locations, 413 North Acadian Thruway, 8372 Skyland Avenue, 3939 Paul Tuckett Street, and 2707 Highland Road. The late owner, Thomas, known as Tommy H. Delpit, with a capital of 35 cents, established what was to come Chicken Shack and a community ice cream parlor, which was a small sweet shop in 1662, East Boulevard in 1935. In 1937, Del Pitt changed the eatery's name to Chicken Shack and added red beans and rice, homemade pie, cakes and seafood to the menu. Lincoln Theater. The Lincoln Theater in the past entertained some of the music's biggest stars in the mid, in the mid 20th century. Hey, that. The Lincoln Theater served as a movie house and concert hall that catered to the black community in Baton Rouge. Over the years, Otis Redding, James Brown, The Four Tops, and many others performed there. Yet, it was more than just a theater. It acted as a community focus spot that entertained civil rights leaders and businesses such as attorneys and barbershops. After it closed in the mid-1980s, it fell into despair. In recent years, ongoing efforts have been made to restore and reopen it. Mount Zion First Baptist Church. Mount Zion First Baptist Church. Mount Zion is Baton Rouge's oldest and most historical church located off of Government Street. Named after its most famous pastor, T.J. Jemison. Mount Zion and Jemison played a key role in the civil rights movement in Baton Rouge and in other places. In 1953, T.J. Jemison helped Mr. Spearhead with the Baton Rouge Bus Boycott, which was the country's first citywide boycott that inspired Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s Montgomery operation several years later. Thank you.